everyone welcome back to my channel i'm neha parashar working in a healthcare company and based in germany in last video we saw what the regulatory procedures for combination products in us are in today's video we will see the regulatory procedures for combination product in the eu we will divide this video in three parts in part 1 we will see what is notify body and what is ce marking in eu in second part of this video we will see how and where to find these notify body and how to approach them for their opinion right and in the third part we will discuss the steps behind these notify body opinion so let's start do you remember from the first video of this series how the regulations of these combination products is different in eu compared to us i explained this in detail in that video that in us there is a separate regulation related to combination products but there is no equivalent regulations in eu like us and in eu these products are either regulated under medicinal product regulation or under the medical device regulation depending on the primary mode of action for example if the primary mode of action is a drug then the product will be regulated as drug under the medicinal product regulation here yeah? but if the primary mode of action is device then the product will be regulated as a medical device under the medical device regulation i also took two example first example was of pfs and auto injector and the second example Example was of a drug eluting stent. For more details, you can check out that video. If your product will be regulated under medical device regulation, then anyhow you need to show the compliance to medical device regulation, right? But even if your product will be regulated under medicinal product regulation, in that case you need to show compliance to medicinal product regulation. But in addition, you need to additionally show the compliance to the applicable medical device requirement. And what was that requirement? That's a GSPR general safety and performance requirement these GSPR are mentioned under annex 1 of the medical device regulation and you need to have the notify body opinion for such devices part except for class 1 self declared devices and that's why the role of notified body comes into picture except this class 1 self declared devices rest all devices need notify body opinion what is this notify body and how this process works we are going to talk about that in today's video so first what is notify body in eu in simple term a notify body is an independent organization that has been designated by the health authority of eu the role of this notify body is to check and evaluate whether the medical devices meet the medical device regulation requirements or not before they can be marketed or even after post approval right notify bodies are an important part of the regulatory procedure for these drug device combination products why because before a product can be placed on the market it needs to be assessed to make sure that it meets all the necessary standard this assessment is usually carried out by a notify body you would have seen that medical devices sold in eu have such kind of ce mark affixed to it right have you seen that if you have noticed it then what does this ce mark indicates the ce mark is also linked to the notify body assessment so notify body they check if your medical device is meeting all the requirements specified in medical device regulation or not this process is called conformity assessment in which notify body will verify all your technical documentation quality system clinical evidences and so on based on which they provide the opinion if your product is compliant to medical device regulation or not based on which we can affix the ce mark on our devices whenever you see this mark this indicates that the device is compliant to the medical device regulation in eu and meets the highest safety and quality standard as per the medical device regulation for integral product like pfs notify body opinion is required right meaning your device part is evaluated by notify body and once they provide opinion you include this opinion in your ma application and submit it to health authority based on which health authority reviews the application and approve your product once this is clear to you you will now see how we should approach to this notify body and what are the steps behind it first step is to find the notify body which can assess our product right but how to find them we will see that in the second part of this video but before we end this video do you know if notify bodies do all this work in free 
or we have to pay anything to them if you know the answer then let me know in the comment section if not then don't worry we'll discuss that in one of the next upcoming videos till then let's stay tuned